Hello, and welcome back to Teleglitch. I am on level 5, the Necrotic Tissue Engineering area. And because of that, I've unlocked level 3, which is fun. Let's see what they did to the place here. I played this level before in the original. Let's see what they changed. Necrotic Organics Reactivation Technologies 5, report number 144. Fusion of necrotic and biotic tissue. We have achieved moderate success in making the living and dead muscle cells work together. The first prototype, a living microchipped rat with reactivated dead legs, was operational. So there was some sort of... Oh, I've, I've already read that before. Never mind. In my first playthrough, I read that. Oh. No. You gotta use the mouse to do that. <laughs> I'm forgetting the basics of this game. I need to use these. The nail bomb and the meat trap. Hopefully I'll have a chance to... Alright, let's go ahead and get the nail gun out. Oh, you can't go in this door. Huh. Oh, interesting. I guess the teleporters are right there. You need to find the, uh, the unlock thing. Woo! I only have seven armor. I don't want him firing at me. Kill him! Kill him now! I think I've already read that. I should get the shotgun over here, too. Okay. Alright, let's get... Whew, alright. Trying to be very careful. Okay, what is this? This doesn't look like the boss room. Can meet. I really don't want to fight the bosses right now. This does look familiar, though. Trying to be very careful. Oh. Ooh. Well, crap, he's got an auto pistol. Okay, let's go ahead and use the canned meat. Alright, poison gardens number six. The plastic death tree has grown its roots through the outer layer of facility armor and thus breached the biology isolation barrier. The tree roots themselves currently block the entrance of any potentially deadly microorganisms, but this breach of security must be neutralized as soon as possible. If a herd of Medusa 1C native amoebas were, were to discover the set of roots, they could possibly enter the facility. No! Amoebas! What are we gonna do? Let's go over here. There we go. AI doesn't seem all that much smarter to me. Haha. -ha. <laughs> I've got a detector, so I know if you're coming or not. That is just asking for trouble. Oh. Oh gosh. Whew. Okay, well, let's go ahead and drop these things. I'll get a million of them from the looks of it. Get this, get this, get this. Alright. Got plenty of ammo. Alright. Let's try and save that. Use maybe the shotgun more. And the nail gun, of course. Pistol, maybe. Is that it? Yep, that's the boss room. Let's go in there later. <laughs> Let's get everything else. Let's plunder this place. And I missed this. Alright, let's use the cheapest ammo we got. And a taser. Ooh. Yay. Taser. I can't use you yet. Oh, shock blade. Ooh. A sharpened slate of metal connected to an electric generator that delivers deadly shocks with each strike. Ooh, that's cool. I don't know if I want to get it. <laughs> hmm. I think I'll deal with what I have. 
See, I really think that the uh, getting using the heavy rifle, uh, I mean, getting the heavy rifle so early makes things a lot easier in a sense. Because, well, in the sense that you don't need to worry about using your revolver for those guys. You have something to use against the big robot dudes, other than your revolver and rockets and stuff. All right, Militech Future Development News presented by Prediction Scientist Consortium Number One. Currently, the fusion of organic and reactivated tissue is still in experimental stage, and technology at its infancy is at its infancy. In 20 years, life as we now, as we now it, as we now it, has ceased to be anything special. We will have grand factories and create clone tissue in one end of the pipeline, shut down or kill its life in the middle, and reactivate it at the other end of the production. This fusion of robotic living and reactivated tissues results in super systems that are not alive, but something greater and more perfect. Interesting way to put it. Let's move on. There are bound to be more guards around here. Hmm. Oh, I should use the pistol for those guys. One of the few uses for them. Ooh, I get to do this. I haven't done this yet. Yay. Ooh. No box. I could use my shotgun a bit more effectively than that. Okay, that wasn't bad. Nail box. Let's go ahead and make more nail ammo. That's already loaded. Let's see. What's in here? Ooh, hello. Whoop. Let's use this. Die! <laughs> That's the teleporter, right? Maybe? Maybe not? I'm not sure. Maybe not. It looks like it. Nope, the teleporter's, I guess, right over here. Huh. What is this? <laughs> well, there's nothing over there. Alright, let's go through this door. And get this. Minigun. I already know about miniguns. Did they up? Actually, did they change the recipe? Four rifles. No, it's just the assault rifle. Change your fusion motor. Yep. It's just the motor and four rifles. And that's it. Assault rifles, that is. Alright, let's go check in there, see if there's anything over there. Any more ammo or anything. And then let's go kill those guys. And let's see if they've made the robots any tougher. They probably have. Well, that was pointless. Okay. Bad news is I don't have any armor. That is pretty bad news. I could... HP. Well, that, that won't work. Uh... None of these things for the large tube are any good, really. Uh, oh well. Let's use this, and then... You guys are worthless. I guess I could carry around... Nah. Nah. Let's see. Yeah, let's go ahead and go into the boss room. Drop you, pick you up. Meat trap, meal bomb. I shouldn't use either of you in here. I don't think either of you would be effective. The revolver, heavy rifle, and the assault rifle, maybe. But really, this is what I want to get a good hit on right on the start. Okay. Actually, yeah. Whoa! Much harder. Okay. Wow. Uh... All right.
Alright, well. Wow. I'm gonna die. <laughs> oh crap, I'm so dead. Wow. They made those guys so much tougher. That's so cool. I don't know how I'm gonna beat them. Oh my gosh. They're so much harder. They spin faster. You need to come up with a better way to kill them now. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. <laughs> That's so good. So good. Alright, that was fun. That was my second attempt. I made it to level 5. I did not beat it. 71% accuracy overall. Meh. Uh, Could have done better. Monsters in the Void 4. I did fail my rocket shot on them. I should have made another. That's what I should have done. I had two cans, didn't I? I should have made another rocket. Oh well. I found eight secrets apparently. Four monsters in the void. Kill the camera. <laughs> Whatever those guys do. Oh man, that was fun. So my attempt number two ended in death on level five. This has been Casey's Crag. I hope you guys enjoyed that. That was... Oh, I love this game. Even though I lost. Oh, that's that that seems like so much fun. Oh, I'm looking forward to beating them. I'll see you guys later.